said he went to a store, walked outside the store, there was a car there idling. And he goes, hmm, car idling, jumps in the car and drives off. He said a couple blocks later, he's like, what am I thinking? Come on over here, sir. Hey, you know me, Scott. Hey, how you doing? I am doing I'm in cuffs. What do you mean, how am I doing? What brings you in today? I, I got drunk and stupid. That's what brought me in. How about drunk and stupid. More specifically, what's going specifically, on? Specifically, you, you know me. OK. Drunk and stupid, basically. Or literally. What do you mean, basically? Michael has been contrite. Michael told us where the car was. So we've I did everything right got the car back. So the lady looked at her car back. That was nice stupid. of him. I did everything right. I, did, I got drunk and stupid. You did some she stuff right. Just had a few drinks and Oh, a few drinks, yeah. So Michael? God, it's been like four years since I've been here. So you've been doing all right until today. I've been great. Until today. I've been doing so good. You don't even know. I just got me a new girl today. Hey, we were just, oh my God, man. I can't believe this is happening right, to me, to be honest with you. This is like totally unbelievable. Five minutes ago, you told me you were expecting us. Oh, I was expecting You had yeah. it still a surprise? Because it was four days ago, but getting drunk and stupid. So I apologize. So I apologize. I told where the car was, everything. So I walked out of the store. The car was started, and I just jumped in and left. So it was out there just idling? No, yeah. It was just right there, started. And I've never done that before, ever in my life. I've never had a UUMB, Scott. You know me. So I've got a lot of charges, bro, but yeah, never a UUMB. Come on, man. So where'd you go? I, I, mean, I just left. And after I went a block, I'm like, holy <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> you know? So you got out the car after like a block or so? No, I you took it to all your Fred Meyer so I wouldn't get in trouble. I thought they'd just um, check somebody out there. I'm stupid, you know? I mean, I'm really a nice guy, though. He was entirely on the video at the store immediately before going outside to steal the car. St to steal the car? I, went, I didn't go out there to steal the car. Okay, I, walked I, mis out I misspoke. You went the outside, was... and then the car yeah, here you go. slid 10 yeah. feet to the right, and you fell into the driver's seat. Bro, the son of a bitch was started. I was drunk. I was like, holy <laughs> there's a started car. I jumped in it and left. Steal me. And three it blocks away. Seductively. You're an ass. Three blocks away. I, three blocks away, I'm like, holy what am I doing? You know, I didn't do this on purpose. I mean, come on, Scott, please, man. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. I fed up. And you're owning it, so that's actually that's, that's right. actually I'm the up, bro, That's a redeeming you know? quality, but you're actually you're actually owning it. So. I know what happened. You know, right. I fed up. Okay. You know, and I wish I dude, I just talked to my new girl and I was like, I just stole a car four days ago. I'm like, hey, I don't even know how to how to um how to make up for it, you know what I mean, as far as karma goes? Because I'm a karma guy, man. You know, I didn't, and she's like, well, we'll, we'll check it out, you know. And, here I am. He said he went to a store, walked outside the store, there was a car there idling. And he goes, hmm, car idling, jumps in the car and drives off. He said a couple blocks later, he's like, what am I thinking? So he goes and ditches the car in a supermarket parking lot. And then they wind up picking him up shortly thereafter. You look good. Hold your head up straight. I always look good. Hold your head straight and stop moving. Go smile. Oh, smile. smile. I can't but smile. No, Take my smile. picture. Come on. Sign <laughs> down there on the bottom. Story girl. One more. All right, so you can go wash your hands over there. He got early release before he talks to the judge. He'll leave, they'll give him a court date. He'll have to come back and then touch base with the judge about what he did, which is basically what we call arraignment, when you're formally told of your charges. Ready to go release? We're gonna stand on the black line. All right, let's head out. Yeah, I don't even let her on no more, bro. She so what's it gonna be, uh, yeah. another four years before I see you again? Yeah, probably, at least that, at least that. But not she for... comes out, come do my barbecue. But not, uh... <laughs> <laughs> not for jumping in cars, island out front of stores. Damn, that not man, this time, that's huh? terrible, man. I feel so bad, you know. I was just talking to my new girlfriend. I'm like, how am I gonna make this right? She's like, well, I know. She never told me. Yeah, I'll be damned if I go to jail tonight. You know, that's ridiculous.
Yeah. Then the coolest thing about it is, you know, you're taking some ownership behind it, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. There's actually, uh, sounds like there's actually some remorse. That's actually redeeming. That makes me think that you might not be coming back in I'm here. I'm not coming back. I'm It's actually... <laughs> So not too busy tonight, so you got, you got cleared a little earlier. Right, he's gonna have you sign some papers, man, then you um, step through that and you know the way out. Right. I know it's been a minute. Take care of yourself. Right. You have a good one, bro. No more cars, right? No. So tonight, he's out. Hopefully, we won't see him back in. And, and the doors open up and they leave me outside. I'm gonna go home to my family tonight. I've been thinking about my home. I've been thinking about my needs. I don't wanna be